Okay, we're gonna do a handstand onto the thigh. So how I like to mount this one is a thigh stand. We'll get a nice okay. squat. The more horizontal you are, the easier it is for your fly to mount. Okay. My arms are pushing up, so she, as she jumps on, I'm not pulling backwards this way. Okay. Right? And really providing that nice and firm, nice low squat, just pushing up. And then she's gonna sit on my shoulder. Watch what she's doing here. I like how she's gonna wrap this forward okay. and this backwards wrap back like this. It creates okay. a nice clamp. So, okay. so um, I mean, for the girlies, you can do this spin. Uh -huh. I'm trying to think what for Zach would be cool. That's uh, <laughs> Okay. So from here, she will start leaning over my shoulder. She'll unbind here. She'll lean over my shoulder. Mm -hmm. And now she's kind of rolling across my body uh -huh. to come forward onto my knees. Oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. This is key here. If this is bent at all, it will not work. You got to keep this locked down. Okay. And if you come forward too fast, it won't work either. Okay. So you really have to go slow. Andrew, you can use your shoulder to help push forward. Okay. Cup the shoulders here and go slowly. The slower that Brianna can go up, the easier it is for me to lean back. Okay. And think about rolling out this way instead of kicking on the face. Okay. It's hard to keep this here by the ears, the biceps, because when you feel pressure in your hands, you don't want to come out, right? Yeah. We squeeze that in there. Like and, and then the more she leans forward, the less you'll feel on the shoulders. That means now you're relying on, on your basis counterbalance to create some some um, kind of this counterbalance feeling where you don't feel like you're doing all the work in the hands. It's some of it, the basis support you by his counterbalance there. Okay. Um, falling wise, you know, falling back into the face, really try to twist out. If you go forward too fast, you can land on your butt, so I'll always try to twist out that way. But the worst part is probably coming back over this way too fast. And falling back over here. Tips for the flyer again. Don't come in where your arms are bent because if you're doing a handstand, you're pushing up from a handstand. Very hard. Very right? make sure they're locked out. And then Andrew can nudge with the shoulder leaning forward while he's pushing you forward a bit. And then don't a common thing also is your flyer will lean back too fast. Go slow. Lean back. And as you lean back then Andrew can learn how to lean back with you to create that counter. And then from there you can do all kinds of cool things with your legs. You can scorpion over here and look down at the ground and create a nice shape. You can open your legs out that way and make sure you lean back slowly so you can turn it with you, okay?